Hey, how's it going? You guys remember cucumbers? I, I forgot about these. It turns out... It turns out these are both good and good for you. A healthy snack at any time of day. Except if you're asleep. Anyways, let's get to the art. Although, now let's get to the art. But I have been trying to eat, eat more of these um, cucumbers. Be more healthy. It feels good it, uh, on my conscience. It's a soothing salve, a balm of sorts. I don't know actually how good it is for me. I know there's vitamins um, and mineral. No, not min probably not minerals. I know there's minerals in the ground, and cucumbers grow in the ground. Maybe it does pick up some minerals. But I feel like cucumbers, they're kind of a fruity vegetable um, in the sense that you can eat them like you do eat a lot of fruits. You know, like you can just munch on it uh, like you would be able to bite into an apple or an or Well, you can't really bite into an orange the same way, but a pear or a... Well, I can't really think of many fruits... All of a sudden, I, I, I expected to be able to just kind of rattle off a bunch of fruits you could just bite into like this, you know? With nothing keeping you from it but a thin peel. And if you have no problem with a peel, you can just eat it. And some people like peeling things. Like I remember my dad, and my, no, my granddad, my grandfather, my granddaddy, he would peel apples because he didn't like the peels. But my mom would never let me eat peeled apples. She would let me eat me peeled apples, but I always had to eat apple peels as well, plain, which wasn't quite as good. It, apples are better, apple peels are better if you eat them with the apple. But what I'm saying is, are cucumbers vegetables or are they fruits? Because people, I'm not gonna go into this, 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 this whole debate about people always like, rocking everyone else's world with like did you know actually cucumbers are actually fruits they're not actually they're not actually even fruits they're actually legumes and then it comes down to this thing about how it's culinarily uh fruit and botanically uh something or other you know it's this way that way and all these there's a thousand different ways to classify everything I don't really care. The point is, I feel good about eating cucumbers. Um, they're easy, they're quick, good to go, little nature's little snack pack of goodness. But one thing I was wondering about is, um, if cucumbers got a little bigger, if they matured a little more, I guess they don't. I guess we've kind of bred them and we've genetically, we've got them growing just how we want them so that they don't get any bigger. But I wonder if they did, if the, the seeds would start getting bigger and badder, and the seeds would start getting to where they were more like watermelon seeds, and they would become much less convenient to eat, and we'd have to start spitting out the seeds like uh, watermelons, even though they do have seedless watermelons. But seedless watermelons don't have seeds like cucumbers, they just have no seeds at all, which seems a little counterproductive, like we've messed up the whole natural cycle and like bananas have seeds, they're just like little tiny dots. But in the Philippines, I remember we'd eat things called monkey bananas, which actually had big old seeds in them, more like cucumber seeds. Those are really fat bananas, fat and short bananas, kind of astringent bananas. Yeah. Speaking of, speaking of watermelon seeds, there's a funny story that I told before, but I'll tell it again. One time, my whole family and I were standing on the back porch of our house, and we were all standing there, me, my mom, my dad, and my sister, and we each had a big old slice of watermelon in our hands. And uh, we were just nomming down, and at that point in our lives, I think we were all watermelon seed spitters. I think later in my life, um, either as a way to show off or just to you know, make things simpler, I became a watermelon seed swallower, um, you know, just to like, you know, make people amazed. Um, it wasn't, actually, it's probably not a healthy thing, but it's not a terribly unhealthy thing 
you don't actually grow watermelons in your stomach if you swallow watermelon seeds. But so uh, we were eating watermelon. The juice was dribbling down our chins. It was like a warm um, summer evening or afternoon or something. And there was a clothesline in front of us going across the backyard, not very far away from us. And we were trying to, there, there were flies sitting on the clothesline and we were trying to hit the flies sitting on the, uh, sitting on the clothesline with seeds um, that we were spitting. We were trying to spit the seeds, the watermelon seeds, and hit the flies on the clothesline. None of us were being very successful, but um, there, there was also a next door neighbor, a couple of little boys that lived next door. Sometimes they would come over and visit us. Um, probably, uh, probably two or three years younger than me. I was the youngest one in our family. And one of them happened to come over that day, but we didn't know he came over because uh, we were in the backyard, staying on our back porch. And apparently, um, suddenly, we heard him knocking on the back door. This was a little weird, though, because we were standing on the back porch outside the back door. And he was inside the back door inside our house, knocking. And so we turned around and we said, come out. And so he came out and he said, hello. And we said, hello. And we're like, what, what do you want? He's like, hi. I, he's like, I, I knocked on the front door, but you didn't answer. So I went inside and I, I couldn't find you guys. So then I knocked on the back door and I found you guys. So we gave him some we gave him some some watermelon and he he couldn't hit the flies on the clothesline either and uh that's i think i think i told this story right i think i did anyways i hope that cucumbers uh you know i don't i don't think it's good to modify i guess we have a modified cucumbers to the point where they don't have se- I feel like maybe, who knows, like maybe 500 years ago, cucumbers weren't as good. I feel like a lot of things might not have been as good. You know, like people always tell about how bananas, like the flavor, like um, banana flavored candy and stuff tastes different because it was like, there's like the whole Cavendish b- banana stuff. It's like based on a flavor of bananas that doesn't exist anymore. Like everything's changing all the time. Who knows? Maybe Maybe cucumbers used to have big seeds and nobody alive now. Um, knows about it. Who knows? Anyways, uh, here's this is a watercolor painting. Okay, goodbye. I love you. You're doing good today. You're doing well. You're you're gonna do fine. Good job.